Home Remedies for Skin Allergy and Itching for Babies Allergies can make your little one feel miserable, but that doesn't mean you can't make it better. You can help them avoid things that trigger their symptoms. And you can also learn about medicines that fight allergies. Home treatments can work, too. Maybe you've noticed a raised red spot on your son's skin after he's been playing in the park. We discussed below the best home remedies for skin allergy and itching for babies. How can allergies affect your child's skin? If your child comes in contact with an allergen, they may develop contact dermatitis. Their skin may appear red, itchy, scaly, bumpy, swollen. If they touch, inhale, or eat an allergen, they can also develop hives. These are raised welts that can develop on their skin and they're almost always itchy. Some children with allergies also develop eczema. This condition causes their skin to become inflamed, itchy and irritated, even when they haven't made contact with an allergen. Can you use natural remedies? Many allergic reactions can be avoided. But accidents do happen. To treat allergic reactions, your child's doctor will likely recommend certain medications. For example, they may recommend over-the-counter antihistamines, prescription antihistamines, or epinephrine. Some natural remedies may also help soothe mild allergic symptoms. But you should never use natural remedies to treat a severe allergic reaction. Always talk to your child's doctor before trying a new treatment for their allergies. Some best home remedies to relieve skin allergies. Menthol application. Menthol oil can help with pain and irritation. Menthol is an essential plant oil that comes from the mint family. It has a cooling effect and may help to relieve discomfort and itching. Peppermint oil, which contains menthol, may help pregnant women with itchy skin. Using a cold compress. Applying cold to a rash or allergy is one of the quickest and effective ways to relieve discomfort and itching. Cold water, whether in the form of a cold compress, cool showers, or a moist towel, can provide immediate comfort by reducing swelling, relieving itching, and slowing the growth of a rash. Never place ice directly on your skin. Aloe vera. The aloe vera plant has long been utilized as a health and skincare supplement. Aloe has been utilized as an anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, antiviral, and antioxidant in addition to wound healing. Aloe leaves have a clear gel that you can use to relieve sore and irritated skin. To ensure optimal absorption, it's essential to cleanse and dry the affected region before applying aloe. You can open an aloe leaf, scrape off the gel, and apply it straight to the affected skin if you have one. Wet Wrap Therapy WWT. It entails wrapping itchy skin in gauze or surgical netting that has been soaked in water. These covers hydrate and soothe the skin while also providing a physical barrier to prevent scratching. This treatment may be especially beneficial to children. WWT may also help in the skin's absorption of medicines like topical steroids. Before putting the wraps on, apply medication to the area and then a generous layer of moisturizer on top. Using warm water, wet a piece of gauze until it is damp. Wrap a gauze bandage around the inflamed area. Using a dry piece of gauze, cover the damp gauze. Your baby should wear bandages for at least a few hours, if not all night. Apple Cider Vinegar Apple Cider Vinegar contains acetic acid, used as a natural wound cleanser and antibiotic for thousands of years. Therefore, it has the potential to be very useful in the treatment of itchy scalps. The National Park Service suggests diluting vinegar one-to-one -one with water. Then, Apply it to your baby's scalp and let it dry before gently washing it with lukewarm water. Do not apply it on cracked or bleeding skin.